If you are considering applying for Changdom Learning or sending your child to study at Changdom Learning, please be aware of the following dishonest, fraudulent, and illegal recruiting practices that Changdom Learning engages in. Number one, Changdom tricks young people from around the world into thinking they have secured a job in Korea when in fact there is no job guarantee whatsoever. Number two, Changdam tricks future English teachers into giving Changdam Learning their original university diplomas and says it is a requirement for the Ministry of Education. This is a lie, and there is no such requirement for the Ministry of Education. If any English teacher does not complete the training week in Seoul, Changdam demands that the teacher pay for the entire cost of their stay in a hotel in Seoul during the training week. If you do not pay for the cost of your hotel stay, you will never see your diploma again. Number three, Changdam agrees to pay for the entire cost of the hotel stay during the training week in the work contract and agrees to return the university diploma regardless of whether potential teachers pass the training week. In reality, Changdam never had any intention of doing so for those who do not pass training. This is called lying. Would you like your children to study English with a company like Changdam? Number four. Changdam creates fake, fraudulent documents resembling work contracts to trick potential teachers into thinking it is a real contract and that they have secured a job and an employer in Korea. This is not the case, as the document is not real or valid. The real contract is signed after you have successfully passed training. If you don't pass training, you are thrown out onto the street and left for dead. Number five. Changdam conducts the final part of the recruiting process in Seoul so that they can see all the teachers in person before they decide which teachers they want. Changdam does not tell potential teachers this. The final stage of the recruiting process is conducted secretly behind the facade of a training week. The Changdam training week therefore amounts to little more than a final interview before being accepted or rejected by Changdam. A very long way to come and an awful lot of money to spend just for an interview in Seoul, isn't it? This is dishonest, unacceptable, criminal behavior on Changdam's behalf. Number six. Any potential teachers who fail, in inverted commas, the Changdam training have their visas canceled almost immediately. Even teachers who wish to remain in Korea to find another job will have their visas canceled. Changdam tells these teachers that they will give them a release letter and then goes to immigration and cancels their visa. Changdam also tells all of the teachers who are not accepted by Changdam that by Korean law they have to leave the country immediately. This is completely untrue and is Changdam's attempt to eliminate all teachers they have exploited as soon as possible. Is this the type of company you would like to work for? 7. Changdam offers English courses at a variety of levels ranging from beginner to near native levels of English. During the recruiting process, Changdam matches candidates with Changdam branches who require different types of Changdam courses. However, Changdam does not reveal the type of course nor the nature of the course to the candidate until they have arrived in Seoul for the training week. This often results in teachers being required to teach courses they are, that they are not qualified to teach or have insufficient experience to teach. In one case, an incoming teacher who had no teaching experience whatsoever was required to take an advanced English course for near-native speakers in critical thinking skills. This resulted in this person being unable to complete the training week due to Changdam's substandard and dishonest recruiting practices. Are you prepared to come all the way to Korea and risk being forced to take an English course that you are unable to teach? Failing training will incur great cost to you. No flights will be reimbursed as promised, you will have to pay for the entire cost of your stay in a hotel in Seoul, and your work visa, which took weeks to obtain, will be cancelled within days. Of course, Changdam won't tell you any of this. 8. Changdam lulls its potential teachers into a false sense of security that they have actually secured jobs when nothing could be further from the truth. This is done with a promise of a relocation bonus and a signing bonus totaling 500,000 won, as well as your flight to Korea reimbursed to the value of 1 million won. All of this is stated in a phony employment contract, and if Changdam does not accept you, you will be left out of pocket for thousands of dollars. Do not expect to be reimbursed for your flight to Korea or to receive any kind of bonus when coming to Korea to work for Changdam. Changdam will deceive you into thinking all money they agree to pay you is guaranteed.
it isn't. If Cheongdam or any other Korean English school does not pay for your flight to Korea and only offers to reimburse you upon arrival, do not work for them, as often this money is never reimbursed. There is a legal term for luring people into coming to other countries for exploitation by deceptive practices such as promising employment and money. This is called human trafficking. The United Nations defines human trafficking as the recruitment, transportation, transfer, harboring, or receipt of persons by means of the threat or use of force or other forms of coercion, of abduction, of fraud, of deception, of the abuse of power, or of position of vulnerability, or of the giving or receiving of payments and benefits to achieve the consent of a person having control over another person for the purpose of exploitation. This defines human trafficking in the broadest sense possible. However, if we were to abbreviate this definition so that it more closely resembled the activities that Changdam Learning engages in, it could be defined as following. The recruitment, transportation, and receipt of persons in a position of vulnerability by means of fraud and deception for the purpose of exploitation. This abbreviated definition perfectly defines Korean English Language Institute Changdam Learning and the recruiting practices that both they and their recruiting subsidiary Eclipse Recruiting engage in. With establishments in Korea and America, and also previously in Canada, Japan, and Australia, this constitutes a cross-border human trafficking syndicate. Changdam has decided to cut corners in recruiting costs so that bringing potential teachers all the way from America, Canada, Australia, and other countries all the way to Korea just for an interview is something that other English schools in Korea could only dream of. Cheongdam does this on a weekly basis. And every week, people who thought they had a job with Cheongdam are thrown out onto the street, have their visas cancelled, and have to leave the country, and are left thousands of dollars out of pocket for the whole traumatic experience. Such criminal behavior is morally unacceptable, and somebody has to put a stop to it. The Korean legal system is in many cases not a platform for enforcing the law or obtaining justice, but rather a means of protecting large Korean corporations from the individuals they exploit, as well as protecting the Korean economy. Therefore, it is not possible to address the issue within the Korean legal system. If you or somebody you know has been exploited by Changdam in the same way we were during the so-called training week, please join us, the Changdam Survivors. We are a group of individuals who have been exploited by Changdam Learning during the so-called training week and collectively have been left hundreds of thousands of dollars out of pocket. We are hoping to launch a criminal class action lawsuit against Changdam Learning, their recruiting subsidiary Eclipse Recruiting, and all other affiliated companies such as CDI America and CDI Holdings. This class action lawsuit will take place in either the American or Canadian legal system. Regardless of which country you are from, if you were unable to start your job that Changdam Learning promised you because you failed the training, in inverted commas, you can participate in our class action. You will not be required to appear in court if you do not wish to, and participation in the class action will be at no cost to you. Please contact us at thechangdamsurvivors at yahoo.com, and we will be in touch with you shortly. Needless to say, the Changdam survivors do not recommend anyone apply for any position with Changdam Learning, either through Eclipse Recruiting or directly through Changdam Learning. We also do not recommend any Korean parents send their children to Changdam Learning to learn English, as this is only supporting criminal activity. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you have any questions or comments for us, you can contact the Changdam survivors at thechangdamsurvivors at yahoo.com. Thank you.